Yo, did you know that there are at least 12 pairs of shoes releasing this week? And if you actually count colorways, that number jumps to 33. There's a lot to choose from. Let's start the show. What up, folks? Jacques Slade here. Welcome to the Heat Check. Glad to have you join me for another show. Today, let's kick things off with shoes that actually released yesterday. Adidas is going hard. First, let's start with the women. They get the Adidas Pure Boost in five different colorways. This is a, a slightly different version of Pure Boost. And uh, if you've seen the last week, it's actually called the Expose. And you can grab all five colorways of that shoe over at Finish Line for $130. On the men's side, Adidas is going with what looks like a gum pack for the Pure Boost. Neither of these colorways are new per se. Uh, I think we've all seen them before, but this is the first time they're actually going to hit retail. There's three colorways and you can grab those for $140. Switching over to Puma and Puma has been killing it lately, especially when it comes to the ladies. They have two pairs of dropping. First one is the Fierce Strap. That one's going to be in black and white. That's going to cost you $120. And then they also have the Puma Basket, which is uh, in all black. And then they have some nice detailing on the top of those. If you're trying to grab that bit of old school style, you can grab those right now over at finish line for $80. Looking to get you right for the summer? Well, that is if you actually run. Adidas is dropping four colorways, two for men and two for women in the Ultra Boost. Now these have been getting a lot of hype online. And from what I understand, they are selling out pretty fast. Some of these actually may be gone already. So if you wanna grab one of these pairs, they're available right now. They're gonna cost you $180. Again, that's for both men and women. On the basketball side of things, Nike is dropping the Nike Kobe AD in the Navy colorway. The Kobe line has been getting a little bit of love in the recent weeks, and this colorway looks very nice as well. Those are going to cost you $160. Getting into some of today's releases, Puma has a shoe lined up called the Ignite Limitless. Now, if you are a fan of The Weeknd, you've probably seen this shoe quite a bit. They're dropping it in black and it's going to be a low top version and that one's going to cost you $110. Next up is the Nike Lunar Epic Fly Knit Low 2. Now, these drop for both men and women and I haven't really seen a big announcement about these, which is weird, but Nike is definitely dropping a ton of colorways. Launching today, there's going to be five colors for men and five colors for women and it looks like they're actually upgraded the fly knit upper on these so it looks a little bit different if you're interested in those and you probably should be those are going to be available over at finish line for 160 dollars now, looking ahead to Friday, Adidas is dropping the brightest colorway we have seen yet of the Dame 3. They're, I think they're calling it Scarlet. For those that know the story of Dame when he was a kid, this colorway is inspired by his coach who would punish them and make them actually hold bricks with their arms extended when they were late to practice or they were messing around. Those are going to cost you $115 over at finish line. Jumping over to Saturday, we have a New Balance 247. Uh, this is New Balance's offering as more of a casual shoe and they've been getting a lot of buzz on the blogs lately. Those are going to cost you $115 and you can grab those at finish line as well. Next up, we have the Adidas NMD Runner. Now, these two pairs are part of the Glitch Camel Pack. Uh, finish line is going to have them in the black and the silver colorway, but there's a couple other colorways as well. Uh, haven't seen a lot of these online, but they definitely look really dope. So if you want to pick those up, you should go ahead and do that. And those are going to cost you $130. Going the retro route, we have the Air Jordan 4 Royalty. Jordan brand took a premium approach with this model using black on the upper, and then they also have these gold accents which look very well and look very nice considering that it's Black History Month. Pricing in lows is going to cost you $190. You can grab those on Saturday morning over at Finish Line. Of course, there are a few other items dropping as well, but I just wanted to bring you the big ticket items that I thought you would definitely want to know about. Uh, make sure you check below in the links for all of the shoes that I talked about today. I am Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line. And as always, guys, I appreciate you. I'll see you soon. Peace.